Everybody, it's NAM 2024. We're at the Bad Cat Stand. The legend is JT. All right. Um, Thank you guys for showing up. I appreciate that very much. Yeah, man, it's our pleasure so, always. We love your amplifiers. Thank you, sir. Uh, big overhaul of Bad Cat last yeah. year. Um, it was a joy to do that video I did with Pete at the end of the year where we looked at all four of the amps. And again, it was a really, I don't know if you want to touch on that because there were so many changes last year. It sort of felt, it took me a little bit by surprise. So I don't know if you want to just touch on that first and then we'll talk about the new Rubicon amplifier as well. Yeah, I mean, we brought in uh, Peter Ahrens to kind of be our CEO and head designer. And Peter just went through the line top to bottom. I mean, just kind of redid everything shot some of my favorite sacred cows, killed them dead, and uh, <laughs> even got rid of the eyes, which they, they pulled them away from me kicking and screaming, but I think it looks good. It's a great looking at Yeah, and uh, it just took us forever to kind of get everything done, and it's all finished now. You're, you're selling them, you did a video. I mean, they're popular. We're, we're blowing them out the door at 100 miles an hour, and I'm building them faster than I ever had before. And uh, now we've got something brand new that we're showing at the NAMM show. So, I mean, obviously it's a, a compact, a much smaller format than uh, amps that you've made in the past, but it is going the way of the modern guitar amplifier now, where we've got uh, cabless options, two notes IRs yes. built in. But yeah. give us the, what is the, give us the It's essentially, it's, a, it's sort of, I hate to use the phrase lunchbox amps, but that's kind of what it is. We're calling it the Rubicon. It's a two channel, two mode. So there's a, a sort of, a, each channel has its own high and low mode. So it goes from like clean to crunchy to like you're scaring the kids. Everybody hide under the bed. Uh, and it's just share tone stack. Presence has got a one watt switch. But I think frankly the master volume works so well that you almost don't need it, but yeah, some people are attached to that. Uh, then it also has a, in a deal we did with the two notes. It has the two notes capture built into it. Uh, MIDI controllable, so you can take a MIDI switcher and you know switch to different cab IRs and different channels and different modes. And uh, as all things Bad Cat, it sounds freaking amazing, right? Take us so let's set let's set ourselves up on the clean okay. channel and there's a master, at twelve o'clock, man. There's a master got, level. Uh, little bit of at twelve o'clock. We've got a little bit of reverb and delay coming from uh, the H9 and yeah. the Valente. So yeah, not not. Uh, no reverb inside here. Actually, yeah. can you get the reverb via the two notes thing? I think you can. I believe yeah, so. If yeah, it's in, torpedo, you can do it like that, but yeah, it's coming out not, of the... not from the cab output. Right, right. Um, so, yeah, here we go. That's a clean channel, and you can drive that. Just a little bit of soft breakup, kind of jazzy. Are you getting these EL84s in here? Two EL84s, yeah. Okay, so you're getting, what, 25 watts? About 25 like watts, yeah, yeah, 22 watts. And then, what, just normal preamp tubes? Yeah, just 12A7s, no EF86s. So yeah. Standard, standard. 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 And then, so here's the, no, here's, here's, the, here's the high mode in channel one. Channel one? Yeah. Well, Peter likes a lot of gain, right? Yeah, a lot of gain. Can we get dial that back for more like an edge? Yeah, yeah, you up? can actually. Okay, the oh, yeah. channel two, right? So he gains up out here. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's more blues here. Oh my god! 
Oh, it's wow. pretty heavy, right? That's awesome. Yeah. You've got a stank face on, Danny. No, but I like it. It's, we're, we're, we're obviously not using the uh, two notes out for the no, no, We're yeah. just mic'd up through regular cabs. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. it does. Sounds great. I, I do like that high level of gain because it, it, you get that liquid kind of sustain on the guitar. It's very liquidy, that's yeah. what it is. Yeah. Very wet. It's not, it's not harsh at all, right? No. It's like super smooth on the top yeah. end. So Do you know what this is going to be price wise? I, I believe it's going to be twelve ninety nine it's US. Great. Yeah. Not bad. And I think it's we're, we're not sure what color we're going to bring it out in, but with red was was the plan. But uh, me, we didn't me, like this red. Let me see the back okay. of it. Then. We'll just use this one to yeah. show. So yeah, it won't it won't be in this color, but what's going on here? Speaker Speak outs, outs with eight ohm, sixteen ohm headphones. Ooh. Headphones, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really cool. And if you are using it, if right. you take the, the, I didn't hear if you spoke about the speaker cap out, can you still run it? Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It does not cool. need a speaker cap to it plug need, into Yeah, it so it's got a load box built into it. That's right. super cool. Exactly. Yeah. Very handy. USB C. Is that so the, the two notes connectivity is not Bluetooth, right? The two right. notes connectivity is USB. USB. Yeah. Yeah. USB. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And does that's this right. little thing come with it? Uh, yes. Yeah, so. Here's the yeah, push switch. I love that handle. It's a good handle. That's cool, right? isn't it? What a good it idea. Is, it is like, like a lunchbox. Yeah. Yeah. And it's easy like, to put another exactly, one on the summer. Exactly. Right? It's, it's a, lo a proper lunchbox handle, exactly. isn't it? <laughs> yeah, you, can make, you can bake cookies in this thing. If you get a sliver out here, like a slide-in tray. Pieces of cheese. What's that? Pieces of cheese. Yes. Oh, yeah, the, sure. Yeah. Toasted cheese Coins. sandwich. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, It's a cool there, design. Who there, came up with the design on this? Well, I think that was Paul, maybe our, our, our IR internal and marketing guy kind yeah, of did yeah. this, design guy did this. I think it was him. Yeah, it looks cool. I'm not sure, but I think it's kind of cool, right? Anything else coming from back camp this year that we should know about? Uh, there are a couple very cool things coming. Um, there are... There are what, this? Some pedals that are being worked on oh, at the this, moment. Oh, this, and this, there's CBD. A, there's a fuzz. There's an octafuzz. There's a CBD drive. And uh, those should be out pretty soon. And there's this mystery guy over here I can't talk oh, about this is yet. One of yours as well, is it? I think it's going to be like a real heavy high gain pedal. Oh, sorry. <laughs> heavy high gain pedal. Holy smokes. If you want well, a little, we can, you want a little cool. preview, I could kind of give you a little preview. Why not? Why not? Xavier. Okay, it's going to clean sound. Again. What, is, it. what does the CBD stand for? CBD, that's the... Uh, I know what that is. Uh, we're in California, right? Oh, that, so it is named after that? Yeah. No, it's Cub Drive. Cub, Cub Drive. Drive. Is it what that? Cub Drive. Ah. Yeah. It, does the optic parts work? That is crazy, yeah. I'm not sure I even know how to use it, but let's try it. Which gives you crazy riff possibilities. It's yeah. like 
So if you want, if you want to show you something really quick, okay. okay. Where are we in here? Nice, I like it. So, yeah, that, that, is, that is something which is probably going to be released around May or June. Okay. Um, obviously, we don't have artwork finalized yet and stuff like that, but the yeah. electronic design is, is done. Okay. Um, and so we're looking at, at this point, five pedals which we want to release over the course of the next. That's really interesting. I like it. I like that. Is this going to be the design? Is this like a design? Yes. that you're going to go with, because I like the recess yes. top with the knobs, so that the switch goes up a bit further, so you don't step with the step on it. It's really cool design. I mean, pedals, there's so many pedals, all the time, everywhere, all the time. And it's nice to see something that just has got a little bit something different about it. These are not, these are not subtle differences, they're entirely new designs. Yeah. Um, none of them is a take on anything, it's, yeah. it's just what I felt like the metal market is missing. Yeah. Although there are so many, and there are so many good ones. I love yeah. so many battles. I can't, I can't name them. But <laughs> um, nevertheless, there are some which, or let, let me say, it feels like I, I designed them for myself. Yeah, know? but that's the, that's the whole point of things. Yeah. Design something that you really love. And then just go, here you go, have under this, you know. Because it's, it's a saturated market full of pedals. So you have to come up with something from someone who's got something to offer yeah. that's not there already. Did you, know. you play this one? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so... Well, well this one is... Is that is that the part of this then? Yes, but it's like... It's like, oh, this is the... Yeah, <laughs> we don't have the... The unpotting is up. Yes. We have a 312. A 312. Coming. This is a 312. How oh, cool! Um, the reason for that is That's not just yeah. to do something for the sake of doing it. It's I was always bothered by um, the the woofiness of most 412. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cabinet. So what we did is we experimented with different speaker combinations yeah. in, in the vertical form. And, uh, I love. How this turned out. Yeah. It's That's it's interesting. got the character of a 412 inch yeah. but without the woofiness. It yeah, always cool. stays tight. So um, it also beautifully matches with our jet bag because yeah, now yeah. the form it is all the form is the same and the same exactly. as cool man. So thank you very much guys for taking us through yes. and uh, hopefully we'll get this into and some decent videos. Very and good. as always, legends. Thank, thank you very much. much. <laughs>